All right, this is Teddy Burris, and I'm going to show you some ideas that you can use to help you find emails that you have lost. First of all, the search email, this box right here, on any window you're looking at, I don't care where you are, you're going to have the ability, no matter where you are, to appear to search, okay? So I can go up into the search box, let me go back to my inbox right here, I'm, I'm, I'm moving between boxes, I'm in my Gmail, but I'm moving between my inbox, my sent, et cetera, et cetera, from over here, this is right here. So I'm gonna click on inbox. Now I'll say I wanna find an email that you know has the word Randy in it. Type Randy, hit enter. There's emails with the word Randy in it. Say I wanna find an email with the word T-square. Type T-square, hit enter. There's an email T-square, okay? Hit the X, it'll take you back to the full, take me back to the full list. Sometimes I have to click on inbox to go back to the full list, okay? Click on there, go back to the full list. You can type in any person's name, okay? Click on that box, type in Helena, and there's the email from Helena. And I can see it's in my inbox, all right? I'm going to click on inbox, refresh, there's the whole list. But let's say I don't see my email up top here, and I'm wondering where it is. A couple things to look at. First of all, go over here where it says 1-50 of 51, or whatever your numbers are. Make sure you're looking at newest and not oldest. If I'm looking at the oldest, it's going to show me this right here, and i got to hit this button to go back to see more. Make sure you're looking at newest, okay? A newest would be grayed out if you're looking at the newest, all right? So if you may not be looking at it in the right order, it may be lost, okay? Next thing. So let's say I don't find it here. Let's go look at one more thing. See where it says more right here, more? Click on more. Let's go look at all mail. Scroll down, go to all mail. Now this is all the mail. This is all the mail that's in my inbox and all mail that is uh, um, in archive. Now, by the way, email that's in archived are any messages that you took out of your inbox. Whether you did it on purpose or whatever, it's taken out. So let's, again, make sure you look at the top of the list, newest. All I'm doing is hover. Go over here and click on, uh, either have, if I have to, click on newest, but I am. Click on oldest, look what happens. It flips the order upside down. Hover over these numbers, click on newest. I'm looking at the top of the list, all right? So if you see it here, but it doesn't show up in the inbox, so I'm looking at all mail. Scroll down, and I find some messages that do not say inbox. You're not going to see them in the inbox. These messages right here are not in my inbox. They have been archived, which only means removed from the inbox. So if I click on these, highlight those, whatever I want, and over here, here's the icon, move to inbox, click on that icon. Now you'll see they say inbox, and I have to uncheck this, okay? Uncheck it to get rid of the checkbox. All right, so maybe they're not in your inbox. Again, go to all mail, make sure you're looking at the top of the list, and see if you can find them there. Last chance. The last chance to find an email that you can't find. Go to your trash. So look in, uh, and by the way, anything that's not, all mail is everything above. Spam and trash are not in all mail. Maybe it's in spam. Click on spam, see if it's there. It's not there. Click on trash and see if it's there, okay? By the way, any messages that are more than 30 days old will automatically be deleted. Okay, they'll let it happen automatically. You may find that the emails you're looking for are in your trash. If they're in your trash, then what you have to do is select them and go up here, hit move to, click on that icon there, and move them back to inbox, right here, inbox. Now they're out of trash. If I go back to my inbox, those messages have been moved back in here. I don't know which ones they are, but I know for a fact they're moved back in here. All right? Bottom line, make sure you look at the top of the list, step one. Step two, search for them. If you know the guy's name was Maxon, do a, type in Maxon, hit enter, find the messages, see if it's in the inbox or not. Step three, go to more and look in all mail. See if you see it there. Again, make sure you look at the top of the list. And in all mail, I can type in Maxon again, and I can find that message is there, okay? So make sure, and by the way, when you have to redo that, you can click on all mail again. Last chance, look in spam or look in trash. And either one of those, you can do a search, 
and see if you can find them. If they're here, select them, click on move to, and move them back to inbox. I'm Teddy, and I hope that quick little video is helpful.